Whether toasting our friends with champagne or enjoying a glass of rum and eggnog, alcohol is often a part of holiday tradition. As Katherine Hansen tells us on today's To Your Health, there are ways to celebrate without overindulging. And now, To Your Health, brought to you by 3rd Avenue Pharmacy and Heart Drugs. It's the season to celebrate with family and friends, with parties and gatherings galore. It may become difficult to control your alcohol intake. Overindulging this holiday season can lead to some serious health risks. You have people who, at the holidays, their drinking goes overboard. And they're at risk for having accidents, they're at risk for having health consequences, they're at risk for social and emotional consequences. The, again, that I'm sorry about what I said last night phone call that you have to make because you had uh, seven or eight drinks instead of three. For some, the holidays create stress and anxiety, triggering excessive drinking, which often leads to bad decision making. Emergency rooms typically see a spike in alcohol related incidents during this time, not to mention the extra calories associated with drinking and the food eaten while intoxicated. If you're going out and having a bunch of drinks, chances are the food that you eat at the same time is not going to be what's good for you. You're not going to be eating carrot sticks, you're going to be eating chips and a whole lot of empty calories and so forth. There are ways to support those who don't want to drink as the host of a party. It can be a good idea not to center the gathering around alcohol, focusing on food, holiday spirit and the company instead. If you're at a party uh, with people and you see somebody having their fifth drink, you know, take it upon yourself to say, hey, are you okay? You, maybe you want to slow down. If you're having a social event, if you're hosting something, make sure that you have non-alcoholic options for people. Make sure that you have healthy food items so, so that they're not um, piling on empty calories on top of the alcohol. Long-term health risks of alcohol use can be reduced by drinking no more than two drinks a day for women and three a day for men, depending on age, body weight and health. And when celebrating this season, it's a good idea to drink in a safe environment and set limits for yourself. To your health, Katherine Hansen, CKPG News.